I here is another challenge lock. This one got Ben written on it. It's a neuro cylinder, six spinner, and it seems uh, that somebody took open uh, these uh, holes. So I expect uh, some trading, uh, some traps over here in the Bible. You see, it's uh, not a very difficult keyway. I don't know this brand Q, I don't know. I really don't know. And this is the key. It seems a normal beating, but I don't trust this. I don't trust this. Here there is written TS14. I really don't know much about uh, this lock. So, if you know it, please let me know something. You are welcome. So, now let's try to pick it. Okay, ready to pick. Uh, sorry, by there's, there's a little mess on my table. Uh, some, um, some presents arrived. You see the munition pins, uh, uh, some uh, key extractors, uh, sorry, some uh, wafer picks, uh, and here my black flag picks. So now I have to study the impulse locks properly. Some, uh, some waiting list, uh, and uh, here are some. Uh, some locks that are driving me mad <laughs> recently. But now we are here to pick this one. I did my homework and discovered that this means that this has been made by Tensile Spider. So let's see if it works. Okay, no problem. I also made a little reference mark on it so you can see it moving just to make you see better. Now I choose to use the biggest tension tool and my old faithful Let's see what we can do. Uh, okay. I'm picking on this little ledge on the right. Uh, this lock usually talks too much or doesn't talk at all. And now it's a little camera shy and don't wanna talk to me. Okay, now Better. Uh, we got some little clicks, a little movement of the core. from the reference mark that the core already has turned a little. But it's not very cooperative just now.
Okay, just touch at five. You saw a decent movement. Now I feel some resistance. Maybe just yeah okay we've made it we have an open so now let's do a decent gutty session I hope so just okay so we have the key, I close this and let's try to remove this circle clip. I hope I have the right tool. Oh. Take two! Mm. I never used this tool so I'm not very Take three! Mm. Okay. Nope. Nope. Oh. Sorry for this, but uh, we have to learn by doing. I hope to finish doing this by Christmas. <sighs> I know, I know, I can hear you laughing, but you know. Oh, thank, thanks God. <laughs> A little fight. Okay, let's be a little bit more. Oh my god, it's really tight. The thing, how can it be? <laughs> it seems candid camera. Okay. I won this battle, oh my god. <laughs> okay, the key. Never found a sir clip so difficult to remove. Okay, now let's shim it properly. I don't like this. It's not cooperating. This lock is a little difficult lock. It's very strange. I don't trust this. <laughs> I think just a really sharp tipping, just trying to resist. Oh my god. I don't want to make a mess of this. Let's try. Okay, we have to try and be quick and let's hope for the best. Okay, I 
know this will be painful. <sighs> we did it. Sorry. You see all these beautiful working pins. Okay. All have to be picked. Just number six is very close to the shear line. Now let's dump them. Okay. One, one at a time. The first one is serrated. The second one is a partial spool. So the third one. Uh, almost like a torpedo number four. Number five. Always a spool. So number six. Inside there is a beautiful work of threading in all the chambers. Really beautiful work. Now let's go upstairs and see slowly what's inside. So, let's see together. Wow, long, long pin. Very long pin. Homemade. We, go, we have some shy spools. So, sorry, springs. Okay. I decided to get it uh, normally. I don't want to touch uh, the grab screws because it's always difficult to set back them at the right uh, point. And also I don't want to touch too much the springs. Yeah, homemade partial spool. Another spool, this one is commercial. Came out and say hello. My little spring. Ah, yeah, this one has suffered a little. There's always the chance that they become mangled around the grub screws. Yeah, another partial spool. Yeah, oh, nice steel spring. Now, oops. Another spool. No, this one doesn't want to come out. We'll do it later. And another partial spool with its spring. Now the last spring, let me see. Oh, here it comes. Nice spring, okay. So, inside, let's see inside. Okay, I can see threadings in all the chambers. I need to feel this. No, actually, this is very light. Chamber number one is very, very light. But yeah, definitely threaded. 
in all the chambers. So this was Tensile Spider 14 Challenge Lock. And now we'll do some close-up of the pins. See you, bye bye!